You ready? to lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. He seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Looking to land the right just out of range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. All right, here we go. First round is underway. No denying the big reach advantage for him tonight. We'll see if he can get that jab going early. Look for him to circle on the outside. Use that long jab to keep his distance and only engage on his terms. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it stop throwing. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. That's a big strike right there. Back and forth we go here. Watch knees to the body. It's such a fast leg kick. Beautiful kick. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Beautiful body kick. His leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. What a body kick. Blocks the shot. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Gonna shut your body off. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, spinning back fist lands. Massive head kick. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick. Yep. Oh, blocks the shot. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Leg kick. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Beautiful strike. And they separate. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Oh! Massive kick to the head. Powerful leg kick lands. Nice punch, man. Back and forth we go. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. 15 seconds. Ooh, head kick, man. He's hurt. 
Ten seconds to go. Round two straight ahead. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, so the next Ready? round is underway. Will it be Ready? more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to fall. There as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Unable to land with that punch. I mean, he's cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, a huge block there. All right, let's go. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to his bullet. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Great punch. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Real quick leg kick. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. That one stuck in. Nice strike. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Straight right hand, no good. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, and he counters effectively with a jab upstairs there, DC. I know you don't often have the reach advantage, but nice to see him making good use of it in this match. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. That punch, no good. So there it is, longer reach, paying dividends as he counters with a punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Just misses there with the left. Oh, that is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up with I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Great punch landed with so much power. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Lee going with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Beautiful straight counter. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, 
30 seconds to go in the round. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pitch. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Final seconds. He blocks the punch. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so a big round four in there, maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there courtesy of the kick. DC, talk us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. All right, next round is now underway. Previous Ready? round, not necessarily Ready? a tough act to follow. Pretty good, not good. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much... Oh, what a job to get the head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Nice connection with a punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Right hand upstairs. Nice slip to avoid the left. Big leg kick lands. Now he counters with a right hook to the head. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And a nice left hand there on the inside. Just misses with the right. He's hurt really bad. He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched blow. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both